there, it's Julie Kinnear of the Julie Kinnear team and I'm standing right in front of 22 Ridley Gardens on this gorgeous summery kind of day in the fall. We're here in the heart of High Park in Roncesvalles Village. What a pretty little street it is. 22 Ridley is this great Edwardian two and a half story semi, four bedroom, two full bath, finished basement. It's a great spot, upstairs laundry, lots of bonuses. Uh, and you can see this really super quiet street. Uh, really super friendly, everybody just gets along great. There's even a little email group to keep everybody informed. There's an annual street party, tons of kids and families, uh, and that sort of old fashioned kind of nice little community here. We are of course in Roncesvalles High Park, which means that we're steps to the Ronces shops, restaurants, TTC, easy to get downtown by streetcar. We're right at St. Joe's Hospital. If you work there, it's great. And I'm going to give you a little more about the neighborhood later because, hey, we're in the house and how awesome is this? So they've enclosed the front porch, major bonus, if you got bikes and strollers and that sort of thing. And of course, it's wonderful in the uh, inclement weather to have a drink, a hangout, what have you. It's nice to have it all more usable space. And as you walk in, there's a real wow factor. What a beautiful open concept. Everybody loves the open concept. It means you can obviously have lots of furniture and what have you, but also great for entertaining if you've got kids. Nice to keep an eye on them. Uh, this is really usable space here. Uh, you can see there's rad system there. Hot water rads are really popular. This is, you know, a 100, 110-year-old house, and that nice radiant style of heat that's nice and even allows uh, for warmth, and, uh, and they've got ductless air conditioning to cool you down in the summer. And of course, if you're a chef, you'll love this kitchen space, lots and lots of elbow room, great prep space, tons of counter tops, nice uh, stainless steel appliances, and uh, looking out into the very pretty yard. So great ceiling height up here, pot lights. Uh, you've got you know, plenty of windows on that one side. And uh, it's a really, it's an awesome, <laughs> it's an awesome main floor. How great is the uh, exposed brick? Love it, there's a pantry. They've made a lot of use of um, glass doors for lots of plenty of extra light. It's nice to have that divider there because uh, this is the entrance to the basement, but it also means that if you wanted to have a separate suite for the basement, meaning nanny suite, in-law suite, rental suite, what have you, it's nice you could sort of cut that off or block that off and, uh, and you know, you do have your own space. Now this, of course, walks out to the backyard. How pretty is this? These beautiful mature trees. Oh yeah, and here we are like in the heart of High Park and uh, you really get the benefit of that. And you can see how pretty it is with the interlocking brick. This is a brand new deck and uh, lots of space for gardening or entertaining or what have you. Barbecue season is still here. And, uh, and I'm gonna show you down into the lower level next. And as I said, it's a finished basement. It's got three piece bathroom, one of the two full bathrooms. So, uh, you know, obviously it's fantastic as a, you know, hanging out space, playroom, great big TV area, what have you. Uh, or, of course, if you wanted to convert it, you can have it if your teenage or grown kids want to stay down here. How great is that? A nice big three-piece with a separate shower. And there's tons of storage. I know that's always a must-have on people's lists these days. And it's nice to sort of cut it off and hide it back here. Here's the, uh, that's that boiler we were talking about. And uh, newer laundry sinks, the copper plumbing. Uh, wiring has been upgraded and uh, many of the windows have been up upgraded. It's all good. So I hope you enjoyed the tour. There is uh, another video of the second and third floor. Uh, it's a very spacious house. It's great for your family to grow into and of course this neighborhood is such a winner. High Park, the shops on Ronsi's, Garden Avenue Public School is amazing. Great community, nice quiet quiet street. You could live here a long long time. There's people of all ages here. Kids, families and People have lived here for 40, 50 years. It's awesome. And uh, of course, St. Joe's Hospital, if you work at the hospital or uh, if you want to get downtown, it's easy to get on the TTC. And uh, if you're a walker, runner, jogger, biker, the Martin Goodman Trail and, and uh, Lake Ontario is gorgeous to do that as well. Thanks for checking it out.